Mama's going to buy me some clothes. <laughs> They're having a sale. Special savings on shoes. I'm going to look at the zip-up boots. That's exactly the type of thing I'm looking for. Got them in black. I'm going to try on some boots. He's checking for a nine and a half. These are beautiful. <laughs> Found some? Yes, sir. Great. I have to thoroughly check out eight pair of shoes before I know that I don't want it. I don't know if I need a pair of tuck shoes. This black one is hiding from me. Mama's going to buy me a pair of dress shoes so I don't have to wear my boots with my tuxedo. I need pants to go with it, you know. Well, for just for my dress up uh, opening night at the opera occasion, you know. That's, that's one foot. And I need to try them both because of the difference in the size. around in these. That's right. Yeah, I believe that's the right size. Okay. I'll take a pair like that. Okay. Thank you. We are also shopping for dress shirts today. How can you tell where the dress shirts are? These are dress shirts? I have to get a salesperson. Can we take a picture for the mall? I'm looking um, for white dress shirts, but not button down and not polyester. For yourself? Yeah. Okay. About um, taking my picture. So what, what about, um, I got great dress, I got getting clouds. Where's that? I got the best made shirts, they're about $49.50. we got for you. What'd you say? You're a 38 38 long? regular. Oh, oh, you're regular? I'm going to, I mean, long, I'm sorry. Okay. I'm going to look for some, a sport coat because they're on sale now. Okay, here's what I have. I have a Beautiful blazer on sale for it was regularly one eighty five. It's on sale for ninety two dollars. Uh huh. I have so little left. You know what I'm saying in that size. So what I was saying now, see that that probably I'd like you to just slip a jacket on to catch the size because some of these are, you know, totally different. Uh huh. I'm telling you, I I, I don't want to uh, waste your time because I don't see anything here that I'm going to want. Okay. What I would need more than anything is something really, really classic and basic and sort of the simplest, most classic type of a cut that I could find. Something that's not even trendy or seasonal or anything. Let me ask you this. Mm -hmm. Let me just get Let me show you what I think is an absolutely gorgeous suit. It's very uh -huh. light. You can wear the pants with a blazer. Mm -hmm. You said you had a blazer. You could wear these pants with a blue blazer mm -hmm. or a black blazer or a camel jacket. Mm -hmm. It's it's called a two and two for one, a two and one suit. Uh -huh. In other words, you this is your suit and then this is how you mix and match. Like you come down here instead of taking a lot of clothes with you, uh -huh. all you got to do is take the suit and a sport jacket and you've got a couple mm -hmm. of days use out of it. Yeah, it's a very classic suit. It's very. Uh, professional, you know. I believe I like, uh, I would, if I were going to get a suit, it would be more on this order because it's just um, like a great, more like a gray flannel, you know what I mean? Mom, he's got suits on sale for, this one's 130 or something like that. Oh, it's polyester.
It sure looks nice, but I don't want a polyester suit. Well, tell him, maybe he's got other I doubt if they do. I, I thought you looked terrific in the blue and the other gray that I showed you. That's a... Well, now, this one is polyester, but Jeannie says it doesn't look cheap, and it doesn't really look like polyester. It's 60% polyester. Uh -huh. It's woolen polyester. It's pretty, isn't it? Yes, it is pretty. How about pants? Do you like it? Well, it comes with pants. Well, I know. Put the pants on. I'm going to try to put the pants on now. What's your name? Laddie Schaefer. Laddie Schaefer? Yes, sir. And he knows Sylvia. Yep. He used to work with Hi, Ted Sylvia. Brown. Hi, Sylvia. How you doing? Sylvia, this is one of your ex-husband's friends. I found him. Now, one thing I don't want is advice on how to dress. That is one thing I do not want. Let me make a knot for you. Is that pretty? How did you meet Sylvia Miles? I introduced myself at a party one night with Sylvia, and then about a week or two later, I went out with some friends, and they were going to the movies with Sylvia. So after that, we became fast friends. And she lives in the village, right? No, she lives on Central Park South at Columbus Circle. Oh. And she's one of the nicest things about New York City. You know, Sylvia was just on Ted's program the other day. I used to work with... with Everybody in New York tuned in because they wanted I, I, to hear that I, fight. I, I, I was the head of sales at WNEW, so I, I know... Not her, I know her husband. He was a... Uh, oh, man, crazy. A crazy man, a crazy man. That, that, that marriage had to be tempestuous. Tempestuous, <laughs> to say I'm the sure. Least. But she was just on his uh, television, yeah. uh, on his radio show the other day, and everybody tuned in, and they had a great time. They're, they're good friends now. Good, I'm glad. And my next door neighbor was Buddy Hackett. No kidding. I can't, the one street in Brooklyn. I in love New York, don't you? Uh, you? You ever hear Sandy Koufax, the pitcher? Uh huh. He lived in the. I went to school with him. No kidding. And Arnold Stang and Joe Bonanno, the mafia guy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Will you open up the box? Okay. Hey, listen, it was great waiting on you. Thank you. I love you. You're a super guy. Have a wonderful <laughs> year. Miss Sullivan, take care of yourself. Well, thank you. Appreciate good. your business. Well, good to know you. Okay. Thanks a lot. Got it all. Nice okay. Trip. Yeah, come in and see us when you come back. I will. Thanks a lot. Say hello to the whole gang in New York. Tell me your name again, so I won't. My forget. name Jose Jimenez. Okay, yeah. Jose. Bye. Where are the socks? Oh, right down here. Okay. Did you see your socks? Yeah. Yeah.